Hello, so today we are working on solving right triangles. So first we're just going to put down what we have. So we know angle A, we know angle C, and we know side A. So when we're looking for angle B, we know that triangles have to equal 180 degrees, so we'll subtract 90 and we'll subtract 35 and we'll end up with 55 degrees. Next, we're looking for this side B. So side B, we want this one right here. So we have side A, so the opposite side, and we want the adjacent side, so we'd be looking at tangent. And right now we know tangent of that 35 equals 5 over side B. We're going to cross multiply. We'll have B times the tan of 35 equals 5. And then we'll divide both sides by tan 35. So B is going to equal just about 7.1. Now, you have a couple options. You could use cosine, or I mean, sorry, sine, to find side C, or you can use Pythagorean theorem. So, if we use sine, we'd say sine of 35 equals 5 over C. We'll do that same cross multiplication. C sine 35 equals 5. We'll divide that sine 35 over. And that will equal 8.7. To double check, we can, also, uh, we can also use that Pythagorean theorem that we talked about. So 5 squared plus 7.1 squared equals c squared. So 5 squared is 25. Seven point one squared is fifty point four one. So when we add those together, and we get just about eight point seven. So again, you can use either Pythagorean theorem to solve for that last side, or you can use that sine of the angle. If you have any questions on solving right triangles, please reach out. Otherwise, have a good night.